There are lots of Android emulators out there, but choosing the perfect one can be a difficult task. So, in today's video, we'll be sharing with you the top three best Android emulators you can find in 2024. Whether you're into gaming or need an emulator for everyday tasks, these options have got you covered. So, without further ado, let's get started. First up, we have Bluestacks 5, one of the best and most versatile Android emulator you can find today. If your system has 8 to 16 gigabytes of RAM, Bluestacks 5 can run really well. One of the coolest features of Bluestacks 5 is its Vulkan support, which uses your GPU more than your CPU. This makes everything run smoother and gives you better graphics with unnoticeable lag. Bluestacks runs on Android 11, so you can play almost any game available on the Play Store. However, to get the best experience with Bluestacks 5, you'll need a powerful system. This means having not just 8 to 16 gigabytes of RAM, but also a powerful graphics card. If your system lacks a strong GPU, even with 32 gigabytes of RAM, Bluestacks 5 might not run as smoothly as you'd like. So if you're looking for a powerful, flexible, and feature-rich Android emulator and you have the right hardware, Bluestacks 5 should be at the top of your list. Next up is Gameloop, an emulator specifically designed for gamers. If you're into popular titles like PUBG Mobile and Free Fire, Gameloop is specifically made for you. This flexibility means it works well even on mid-range PCs. Gameloop is relatively lightweight and requires between 4 to 8 gigabytes of RAM to run smoothly. However, if you're aiming for high FPS in your games, a powerful graphics card is essential. Without a good GPU, you might not achieve the performance you're looking for. I've personally used Gameloop for a long time to play PUBG Mobile, and it was a great experience. While Gameloop does provide access to Android apps, but I will only recommend it for gaming. For Android app usage, there is still something for you. So, if your main goal is gaming and you have a decent setup with a good GPU, Gameloop is definitely worth trying. Lastly, we have Moomoo Nebula. If your system has between 1 to 4 gigabytes of RAM, this emulator is the best choice for you. Moomoo Nebula is perfect for low-end PCs and runs smoothly even with minimal resources. One of its standout features is that it doesn't require virtualization technology, so you can run it under almost any conditions. Also, if your system lacks a graphics card, you can still install and use it. However, the only downside is that it operates on Android 7. This means that you might not find some newer games and apps. But if you need an emulator with a higher Android version for your low-end PC, check out this video. It'll surely help you out. In conclusion, if you have a high-end system with 8 to 16 gigabytes of RAM and a good graphics card, Bluestacks 5 is the way to go. For those specifically looking for gaming with 4 to 8 gigabytes of RAM, there is no better option than Gameloop. Lastly, if you have a PC with 1 to 4 gigabytes of RAM and no graphics card, Moomoo Nebula is the best choice. And that's it for this video, my friends. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.